Hey guys, Freezing Goth 316 here, and welcome to the channel, or welcome back if you're new. And today we're going to be doing a collection tour, which I haven't done at all on any of my channels I have. So this is going to be first, and you guys are going to get to see it. So without with that being said, let's get on to the collection tour. The model starting off the collection tour is Raspberry and Black. She's on the charting, she's on the charting Arabian mare mold, and she is a 2017 TSC special. I got her for Christmas last year. The next model is Newsworthy. I'm pretty sure it's a TSC special or something like that, but I don't really know anything about him. And then we have a little classic Morgan foal. And then we have Othello and the Othello mold, and this is SBH Phoenix. And he's a 2014 TSC special. The next model is a Goffert mold. I'm not really sure who he is. I don't know if he has anything on his stomach. See who he is? He doesn't. But I'm not really sure who he is, so his info will be on the screen. This is the 25th anniversary model. I think it's a celebration horse. He came from Briarfest 2014. And that's it for the shelf. So starting my next shelf, we start with Don't Look Twice, also known as Lipstick. I'm not really, she's an RR, but I'm not really sure what year she was, she was made or anything like that. Like if she was a TSC special, I don't know that. But she's one of my favorite models. I got her at Briarfest last year and at the Clarion. And then the next model is American Pharaoh. He's an RR, and I think he was a TSC special. I'm pretty sure that he was. I'm not really sure what year was created. I think it was 2017 or 2016. And then we move on to my Tatila's Conga. We have Winter Wonderland right here, and he was last year's Christmas horse, and he's a TSC special. Then we have the actual Tatilis, and I love this guy, he's so pretty. And that's why I call him the mold. I love his face. His face is like so sweet. I'm not really, he's an RR, but I'm not really sure what kind he is. And then we have Ishante, and he's a Briarfest special run from 2015 or 16. And I love him, he's just so beautiful. He's LSQ. And all my Tatilas are LSQ, but he, this guy's like so pretty. I love his color, his bay coloring, and all his little like speckles on his legs from where his um, stripes, from where his socks are. Then we have Santana, and I know that he is a TSC special, cause like I am from TSC. I think it is 2015 or 16 TSC special. I'm not really sure though, but he is RR. So that was that shelf, and let's go to the next one. So guys, moving on to the next shelf, the model that starts this shelf is the Irish Draft model from the Best of the British series, and he's just chilling on my shelf, and I got him at my first Briarfest that I ever went to, so he means kind of something to me. Below him we have a cast iron um, Stafford, I think it's like a bull terrier breed, I'm not really sure what it is. And then we have a donkey, this is Ruth. And then we have a customized slash and another dog, and then another dog. And then we have Brass Hat, which was this year's special run horse from the Off to the Races Briarfest. And so the next horse beside him we have... Um, Imper Imperator, I'm not really sure who, what his real name, what his full name is, but he was a special run from, pretty sure, 2016, because that was my first breakfast, pretty sure it is. And then we have this stable mate here, I'm not really sure who that is, then we have the Frisian stable mate mold, which I conga. That white, um, paint, that pin paint one was... A custom. And then above these guys, we have Naz Rudden, which was last year's special run, not special run, but celebration horse for the 2017. Pretty sure it was India or something like that. I forgot that year's name. Pretty sure it was Gateway to India, though. Next guy, we have a wood 
Woodland Splendor, and he is a holiday horse from, I'm pretty sure, 2017. Yeah, no, 2016. He was from 2016, and below him we have some ASB standing mates, and then we just have some of these guys. Not really sure what those ones are. And then we have Bionose, which is on the same mold as him. It's on, I think it's the Zenyatta mold. And I love her, she's so cute. Look at that little skinny she is, look at that cute. And she's all snazzy for my Briar series that I have, and she's the princess, so that's why she's dressed in that. The below her we have some more stable mates, and then we have Picasso when he was the track supply special on Bridger from 2017. Or 16, not really sure about that thing. Then we have this guy, which is my first guy, buy from the Clarion during Pride Fest, and I paid $20 for him, which is a pretty good buy. He is a celebration horse from, I'm pretty sure, 2000, and I'm actually not pretty sure. I think it's 2009 or something like that. And then we have a calf, and that concludes this shelf, so let's go to the next one. So guys, the first model that starts this next shelf is Garrett, and he's a TSC special. And he's from 2017, I'm pretty sure, and we also have a little style mate over here. And then we have Water and Fire from the Ethel series. And then we have another style mate down here. And then over here, after this big space, we have my adorable little Ab Amber from the Amber and Ashley set, and she is so cute, and if you can't see her here, because she's kind of in the shadow of the part, so that's her, and she's so cute. I named her Venus. I think she's just adorable. The next models we have are Baby Flo, and I forgot this guy's name, but they are TSC specials, both of them are. And I'm not sure what year, I think it was 2017, because I got them for Christmas that year. I got her for Christmas, and I got him, I think, in 2016. So anyways, guys, that's the end of that shelf, and let's go to the next one. On the very top shelf, we have these classic Morgans, and then when we slide over, we have these three mountain lions, I'm pretty sure, or Prumas. No, yeah. So starting with the next shelf, we have these foundation stallions. I'm not really sure who he is. Yeah. But this one came from one of the Let's Go Riding sets with the rider and the bridle and saddle. And then we have these little halflingers. I'm not really sure who they are either. And then we have Frankel, which is one of the race horses. He's a TSC special also. And I'm pretty sure he's from 2017. I have two of them because this guy right here is Body. And this one over here is LSQ. And then I have my running Arabian Foals, they're the older model, and I think they're so cute. I have three, I have two on this one, and then I have this, so I guess they would count as a conga. I love the blue roan one though, I think he's really nice. He's, he isn't LSQ, but he would be good for, he's like, I guess PSQ, he has these like weird marks, but I'm pretty sure if I scrubbed him and cleaned him, he wouldn't have them anymore. So next we have these phantom wings, and I love the little pinto foal, he's so cute, if you can see that, look how cute he is. But these guys are LSQ, they're a bit dusty because my shelves need to be dusted. I dusted them the other day, but they are still dusty. Then we get to my adorable little Arabian foals here. These are the older ones, and they are so cute, I love the little white one, and then this one is a glossy, you can't really see, he's like semi-gloss, I guess, if you can see that, he's glossy. I have the running, um, the, I forgot who it was, um, but, I think she's American Quarter Horse, full, I'm not really sure, but she was a JC Penny catalog, so, and then we have this little dude right here, and he's my, um, He's my Clydesdale foal, and he's so sweet looking. I don't have his mother that goes with the set, 
but I do have him because I think his mother was like $30 and I wasn't giving that to for her by herself without the foal. So I just got him because I'm pretty sure it was like $15. The last one on this shelf is this girl right here. I'm not really sure who she is, but I remember trading several things just to get her. I think I traded like two models to get her. Just way too much. I was young and I was like really like her. I traded her for my cousin and he doesn't collect basically. He just has them and puts them in a case and I swear they're so dusty. His models are so dusty. So anyways guys, that's for that shelf and let's go to the other one. So the next shelf we have starts with this girl right here. And she was actually my first briar that was given to me by my mama. And she's very scratched up. The camera won't focus. So sorry, guys. It won't focus. And then we have Starlight or something like that. And she was a web special or a club collector club. I'm not really sure about that. I think she was a web special. And then we have Cincinnati. And I got him a while ago. He was new in box. I don't know anything about him. And we have Traveler beside him. He has a broken leg. If you can see that back there, it's a lot now. And then we have my quarter horse. I do quarter horse or stock horse. I'm not really sure. And then we have Poker Joe. And he was one of my first buyers also. And then we have Cigar. We have Big Ben. Beside him we have Diablo, which I named him that. I'm not really sure what his actual name is. Then we have Cola. Then it's Cola Boy's Pony also. And I got him. I'm not really sure about any of these horses. But and then I have my um, Family Arabian Mare. And then we have my Family Arabian Stallion. And then we have my Glossy White um, Pam, which is a really old one that doesn't have a stamp. Then we have chocolate chip kisses, and after him we have a halfling or a cob, not really sure. And after, no, he's Roy the Belgian, that's what he is. I'm not really sure who he is, I think he is Roy the Belgian. And then past him we have a Clydesdale, and we just have some foals that are past him. You can see that. And then we just have some classics, and that ends this shelf that's really long. So starting the next shelf we have this fighting stallion, he's a charcoal fighting stallion. And I don't, I think he's a collector club or something like that special. I'm not really sure. He was made after the, um, the vintage club model, but he doesn't have a sticker on him, so I'm not really sure about him. Then we have my blue box right here, and another blue box stallion. I think it's a Mustang stallion. I'm not really sure about blue box models, because I don't usually collect them. And then we have, I think, the family Arabian mare. Um, I'm not really sure about her, or the running Arabian mare. Then we have a classic over here, and then we have Black Beauty on the sham mold. Then we have two more blue boxes, and that ends this shelf right here. This pet cow and the black horse right there start this shelf, and I don't really sure about them, so I'm just going to do a little overview. So that ends this shelf. Stand surrounding me, let it play. I should lay still, cold sheet of steel. The rage of me is still nothing left. I should lay, Jesus, Jesus. You make the darkness tremble, Jesus, Jesus.
Next shelf space is my curio cabinet, so let's go into that. Right here we have some stable mates that are just here, and I love my little mini Albie. And then I have some Django's right there, and then we have a cute little slice dog, as well as some of my other clinky dogs, and we have this little collie right there who I just got. And behind them we have the Gypsy Vanner, which is Exodus, and he is a TSC special from I think 2016 or something around that year. And under him we have Bahana, which is a special run from 2017. And on the side here, I have my little conga of these Clydesdales, I'm pretty sure they are. And then beside him, we have a, Briar, a Peter Stone 1996 holiday horse. And in front of him, we have some of these cobs right here. And below them, we have all the one day stable mates. Not um, all of these four over here were from this year. Though that one, that. Um, Tusher is from last year, and so is that running mode right there, and then this guy right here is from 2016, the glossy chestnut one, or silver chestnut. And then we just have some of these metal figures which are worth on my dad's grave. But guys, this is my little collection of Briar Dog and Heartland Dogs, and they just belong in this tour. <laughs> And on top we have this body of flexible and then we have an exclusive Paul Revere and his horse black brown beauty. So guys that is my collection tour and thanks for watching. Bye!